I'm a junior right now. My major is business management and my concentration is public relations. What were you? Uh, I'm a junior. My major is criminal justice. No, I really can't complain. Everything is straight. I've been on the way. But everything I say turn into the real thing. I tell her on it. Cause you know it ain't a thing. We made it at the slums. Words on the page. The fight is last year when I wrestled in the year before. I think that school is yeah. good. Cause and good because it's separated, there's more than I'm eating. Yeah, yeah, that is true. I, do, I think if you kind of like to focus on like the school academic over yeah. there, what yeah. we're done with, I think it's good. Yeah, you cold? Yeah. Cool. You look cold. Huh? You, you cold? look cold, yeah. I, 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 like, I like that. I like that. I thought you said you've been working out. I like that sweat outfit, though. I like that. I like that. Ten matches. Eight. Eight, 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 eight matches. Minimal? Yeah. No, that's it. That match. And they won't even let us do lines. <laughs> yeah, bro, that's oh, really your whole hand. Hand. How long are we doing so this show? So pretty much we're going to kill every single one. What? How long is the show going to be? Oh, I don't know. Oh, so what you do? This is, this is Edwin. <laughs> oh, what up, homies? How y'all doing? I saw you wrestle last time. <laughs> yeah. Pretty nice for you and your brother. I'm going to Edwin. How long is the tour? Yeah. The school is actually like not that big. It's pretty big, but it's not that big. Huh? It's kind of cool. Like, it's, you, to be real with you, it's like kind of normal. It's like, just like two different parts of it. Follow you on Instagram, whatever you got. Like, you got waves, huh? <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I see uh, the waves, though. No, yeah, I'm trying. No, he just didn't really. brush. He didn't brush. It's just I, <laughs> <laughs> I don't take care of my hair as much as other people should, though. Okay. You feel me? People right. do a real good job taking their hair. Yeah, yeah, I feel I just brush myself. Yeah, Juan's gelled up, but he's old school. different. I'm old school, boy. He got he got he got the particles coming out of his hand. <laughs> <laughs> that's a real shit. Yeah. That's that spray on shampoo, right? I wish it was, I wish it was Yo, Juan used to put so much gel, you would think he had gorilla glue on his hair, yeah. Yo, y'all heard about that girl that put <laughs> right? glue on her hair? Oh, oh my god. <laughs> that was crazy. Why would you do that, bro? Like this is crazy. I don't think I'm in the front, like, I don't know where we're going. Oh man, you running to that. Yeah, it sounds crazy to me. It's kind of big, but it's kind of small at the same time, in a way. You feel me? Like, you get used to it. Like, I, I wish I wanted to go to a small school, and Bridgewater isn't a small school, but we have in total, with like commuters and people, what, about 7,000, yeah, something like that. We have max commuters. Yeah, but like, yeah, so like, I don't know. But like the classes are like 16 to 20, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like so it's oh, kind of small. Yeah. Yeah. It's a medium size. Yeah. I think so in the Wigman College was what 12? 10 to 12 students. Yeah. So it's yeah, really it's small. a small population. Yeah, yeah. So so like where you live there, do you pay rent or? So I live off off, off 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 campus housing, right? So what that is, it's like the landlords who just own houses for college. Oh, it's like kids. a wrestling house. Yeah. 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 So that's a wrestling house. So, oh. Literally everyone that lives here, right? Y'all said it too. Yeah, we're like, that's yeah, like, a wrestling house. I said, maybe football too. <laughs> now, yeah, so the, one of my boys downstairs, he plays football. Yeah. So, all right, so this is a dorm. This is Scott Hall. I used to live here. Yeah, so this is like kind of for transfers and smart kids. So, like, if you come in with a good GPA, it's like that, they'll stuff your ass right in here. This is for freshmen. Woodward Hall. That's freshmen. Um, our story's out there, bro. It's crazy. I heard it's haunted, though. I don't know. <laughs> boys, and, boys and girls together? Yeah. Boys and yeah, girls. Boys and yeah, girls boys and girls. Yeah, together. we ain't going in there. We're good. <laughs> We're good. Yeah. Yeah, that's the worst thing you want to do, put boys and girls together, yo. Bro, yeah, but it is what it is, bro. It's hot. Bro, my boys right now in the uh, in Krim on the other side, I'm going to show you there, he dorms with a girl. Like, in his room yeah, is a girl. They let you do that? Yeah. yeah. In Crimson and Wavy. That's a, that's a building we would take classes in and stuff like that. I've never been there. Yeah, that's a history. I had a couple history classes in there. But uh, so this right here is a spot. Let me tell you, Tilly, bro. Tilly, after practice, we all yeah, come with the gang, bro. With the, yeah, and we all just grub it up, bro. Yeah. And like my, my favorite dish is like the chicken, the chicken fingers on Thursdays and Fridays. They're fire. They're like fried. They're like soul food, bro. It's great, it's amazing. Bro. But sometimes like midday, we'll go to Bears Den too. Yeah, we we'll go to Bears Den and stuff like that. Right here, so this, there's like two big dining halls on campus. So it's the Bears Den and Crim. Um, 
they both, I don't know, this one's all right, but I prefer the other one. The other ones you get smoothies and shit. You get smoothies here, but they're like not as good. Now you get, um, you get certain meals a day and cash. So that depends on your meal plan. Okay. You feel me? So I, so since I live off campus and I work, I don't get a meal plan. But then if you live on campus, you're gonna have to pick a, um, a, a type of uh, meal plan. And you had like the silver, the bronze, the platinum, and it just, and this depends. So I had the platinum, I think, and it was like 90 swipes. And oh, like man. 600 uh, dining dollars. Okay. So, oh, yeah, that's so, so right here, they don't mm. Everybody's masked up. Open late night. Take swipes. Open late night. So, yeah, uh, not really. The other one is. The other one's open till 12. This one's uh, open kind of like 8. Yo, I'm asking all the questions, guys. <laughs> <laughs> what about um, work study? I don't know what's going on. Walk up. Oh, yeah, yeah. You yeah, feel yeah, 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 me? So, yeah, I don't have to pay for more for school if I don't have to pay for that. Um, this is um another dorm. This is cold. If y'all ever come here, bro, don't ever try to go to this dorm, bro. This is disgusting. The witch. Like one of one of these one of these kids on the team. He was a weird ass kid, bro. He lived here. His hamster went into the vents and died. So the whole dorm were yet were smelling like uh, dead hamsters and shit. Uh, I don't know how he smoked a hamster in this bitch too. So. Yeah, baby. Yeah, bro. You living in here? You on the third floor and he on the first. And you gotta smell a dead hamster because yeah, that shit went in the vent. Bro, it's not. Bro, bro, I wish I, I wish like things was a lot better. Like I would have saw it like, the way it is on campus right now, bro. Like it's the way, not like this, but going to come over. This is regular classes, you know. People just walking. Bro, it's crazy. Um, I got you, JC. What, what's the girls to play me? Oh, it's a high. It's, it's a high. It's more girls than guys. Yeah. Tell you that much. Yeah. So Georgia, you fit right in. That's that's a good thing, right? Like fifty something percent female. But if I want to go to win it, it's 70%, 80%. What's that about? What's the money? 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 What's no, you can extend this. I heard this is a great um, yeah. physical education, physical training thing. That's yeah. what I heard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I'm yeah. not really big into that, but you have you've been here more. Before. And then I heard yeah. that you don't oh, have to pick a major until after your two years. Yeah. I ain't gonna lie. It's cold. <laughs> it's it's cold out here, man. It's chilly. It's chilly. It's cold. I don't know how you do it with a sweater, man. Look at this one. Yeah. Look at him. He's in his girl's sweatsuit. He's in his girl's sweatsuit. It's my last memory of her. It's super cold, man. That's for real, bro. And I can't prepare. I just all can see. Look at the mask is coming off. Man. Hold on, man. Mask is coming off. Gotta yeah, fix my mask. I see my ears are warm. But, so right now, got my son, my nephew, we just taking a little college walk, taking out some colleges, taking out the campus. They also have like a swim pool here too, like it's all nice, so we have like swim pool. Nice. So we have to get some different conditions. This year was 13k, so I'm. I, I like to say that I'm putting it. That I'm paid. I paid 13k for four years. Yeah, you feel me? Because every 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 year, every semester, like I, I have like a grant or two to pay, and then financially it always looks out and gives me some scholarship or some grant or something like that. So I won't have I won't ever have to pay for school. Taking advantage. Yeah, and it's a thirty. It's a thir it's a thirty thirty five thousand dollars. You know. Yeah. Education I'm getting right. for free that you're gonna get for free, you know, and it's affordable. I think it's probably one of the most school, most affordable, affordable schools yeah. in, in mass. So is it 35 a year? Yeah, 30, 35 a year. Like it depends on what you want to say to. Like my friend, he does aviation. Yeah. Like he does the full program, so I think that's like an extra 10, 15 thousand on top. But like yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. yeah. But he actually like he's learning how to fly planes. He's at like at a strip right now. Like, you know? 
but it just depends. Yeah, you know, you guys want to. I think all that, all that's included in the tuition, right? What? Like like that. Nah, nah, that's so, that's so, so, so that's extra. Yeah, like oh, sometimes it's like an extra like ten, fifteen, like some crazy like that. Oh, my fault. My bad, so good. I went to school for aviation. Yeah. I quit. <laughs> like, nah, not that. <laughs> not because um, because the the math is so different. Yeah, it's so it's, different. It's not like a regular type of knife, man. It's, I don't know. That's too much for me. And, and it was for a guaranteed job. Oh, yeah. It's guaranteed so job, hard. man. That was um, AU. This class was But it was, it was, it was, it was six, six yeah, so like, That's kind of like an abductive class. Right after that, I went first. I did a year, man. That's another thing that's mostly enough. Um, already came apart, so like, it's like but another it building class. It's kind of hard to find, low key. I can't do that, man. Oh, yeah, they always do that. It's not that I'm a quarter, y'all. It just wasn't for me. It just wasn't for me, y'all. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice. I don't know. I don't know who does it too. They just it just randomly appears there. Like, no one I'm not gonna lie, this is a pretty big <laughs> campus. Yeah, yeah, they just put hats on that. Drunk nights. They always do when it's nice out. They always do shit in this no, university. It's, it's, it's a pretty big yeah, campus. They always have like mad shit going on. Yeah, it's, like, it's, it's a university like, though. It's what you understand. You see on movies where you see like kids moving the cloud and there's like tables yeah. and shit yeah, everywhere. Like this is right here. Yeah. So it's all lined up like this. Yeah, like, and like the authorities and then there's like. Like donation things, and then there's like college really stuff, cool, and like a bunch of uh, like decorations for your Wherever the free food is at, I'm there. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> and then, um, Edwin's cooking today. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I know you came from a little bit further, like, you're not from Matthew, you're from like further. Yeah. So, like, how, how long did it take you to get like acclimated and comfortable and feel like things here? So, uh, so, at first, honestly, I wanted to transfer out of here to be real with you. But that was just because I wasn't doing my part in reaching out to and getting to know people. You right, know? Right. So like, you're gonna feel weird at every single college you go to, whether you committed there or not, because that's something that you're not used to. Like, you went and saw the school, you went and met the people, but you never stayed there. You never right. like got to see other people other than the people you already saw. Right. You know, so like, it's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna feel weird. So when I was first here, I wasn't doing my part in reaching out. You know, as like, let me go meet them, let me go interact with them, let me go hang right. out. So at first it felt weird and I felt like nobody was kind of with me, but like once I started doing that, like it just depends on you to be real with you. So now all the words, now you feel like at home. Yeah, I feel at home, bro, because like I kind of reached out and they reached out too. Like it was able, I was, we were able to click too. But like that also just works on like, like it depends on you too. Like you have to go out and, and do something. You have to, even, like you don't have to go out to parties. You don't have to yeah. um, do certain things that everyone else does. You, you, you'll find, yeah, involved. just get involved though. You know what I'm saying? And, and you, you, and, and you're you, gonna find your, your friend group no matter and what. And you chose who you wanna be around with, right? Most deaf, most deaf. And then like being in college, bro, you don't like no one cares. Like you do what you want. No one cares yeah. about what you do, bro. Like like no one judges you, no one like sits here like I don't know. It's like I don't know, it's kinda like yeah. not 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 much out it's mature, but like yeah. you can live your, yourself in college, you feel me? Like no one's gonna sit here and be like you're weird. That's what I was telling my son, I was telling him that. There's a lot of parties in college, man. Yeah. A lot of dorm parties, man. So. Yeah, so there's all that stuff, and it's fun, but like only if you go to them. Exactly. You know what I mean? Like, that's where you meet people. That's where you meet your friends, like yeah. your different friend group. Like sometimes you go to a party, and then that person will be will be from your class that's there. Yeah. yeah oh, you're in my class. Yeah. Oh yeah, yo, bro, what up? And boom, you just create a relationship, yeah. a friendship, you know, things like that. But it's, it's what you college is also what you take of it, bro. That's the one. That's the same. Yeah. Yeah. So right here, this is kind of like a lit party. This looks nice and high end, kind of. Yeah, yeah. So this is Crim. My boys live here and stuff like that. Okay. So this is like better apartments type dorms and stuff like that. Okay. Obviously more expensive, right? More expensive, but the, and it's usually so yeah. It's like, like the it's like the rich side of the campus. Kind of, yeah, 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 yeah kind of. Yeah. But um, and it's also open more to like upper class, upper classes, so like yeah, juniors yeah. and stuff like that. If, I don't know if you got money you can pay for it, they'll let you in. Yeah, like nah, my boys yeah, were yeah. sophomores and freshmen here and they were like they have room. Wagon's here. the mm -hmm. most expensive one. That's the nicest one. Like, oh, you get, like okay. a full size home. This is this is this is like a condo. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Know, it's nice. They got pool tables on there and everything. It's nice. Uh, so then this is the wellness center right here. So I advise you after every weekend of party when y'all get frisky, y'all get tested, Come out and it's free, they just take if they, the school gives you insurance too, which is kinda nice. If you have your own insurance, that's fine. If you want the school insurance, that's even better. It's valid all over the state. So what's this? This is the so cafeteria? This is Prim Dining. This whole, remember we were talking about Bears Den yeah, back yeah. there? 
this is the kind this, of bedroom. This one's open late. Till 12. And then... Is this more like a luxury dining? It's stuff? nice in there, bro. You get pasta, you get pizza, you get uh. cheese steaks, you get like all types all of smoothies. Uh, all you can eat? Nah, I wish. <laughs> <laughs> nah, so, so, when you swipe your card. So the, yeah. the one when you swipe is all you can eat. Alright, that's good. So the one you swipe is all yeah. you can eat. You do what you want. Um, yeah, so we can move up. Why might go heavy than college? Huh? Huh? Yeah, so where's 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 yeah where's the auditorium? Where's the gym at? Do you, do you guys have a sports team here? Yeah, we have a bunch of teams here. So we're about to actually go there. So the first one, it's a football team, right? Uh, yeah, it's a football team. I just want to show you all something. Man. This is why it's so important to be safe. Look, even the bear has a mask on. You see that right there? The red mask. Even the bear has a mask. So, I say that to say this. Keep your mask on. Take care of yourself. You hear me? Keep the mask on. Take care of yourself, man. For real, man. Until this, all this thing is over with. But until then, back to the show. So, I'm still here. Still getting a little tall. It comes to a point, like if you don't, mm. right off the bat, if you don't just pick up on that, by yourself, it comes to a point where you're like, Ooh. Yeah, like, and like sometimes, like, I'm not gonna lie, that needs to happen. The kids are college, just colleges and walk through. We don't get paid for that, but it's just, it's the, the guidance thing. We're trying to, the little, the little things and the fucking, the most you try to help them. Yeah. Better them themselves. To sell the to them, that's it's worth it. Yeah. Like yeah, I got a family. It took us an hour and a half to get here. You got a family. Yeah. We all got families, but oh yeah, for you know, no, no. That's why, like, when the, this COVID shit is happening, they don't let the kids wrestle in sports. Yeah. Some of the kids in sports is a life, man. They, they expect the sports to get them into college and better their lives and keep them off the streets and shit like that. Yeah. So that's why I don't mind, especially Doing this. with one. I don't mind taking a whole day out. To go walk through a college, introduce the kids to college so you can see the difference. Yeah. I don't mind it. But don't waste my time. Yeah. You feel me? Like, if you really want to do it and you're really about it, you want to better yourself, just go do it. Because mm -hmm. what you guys are doing, you guys are taking them out the hood. You know what I mean? Like, I mean, the their environment to bring them to the environment. Yeah, like and even yeah. from the hood. Yeah. And they, they, they still don't have the guidance to yeah. freaking go to college and better themselves. Cause Oh, I'm gonna live. I'm gonna live at home with mommy because she got a four-bedroom house and mini yeah. mansion. Yeah, but when your mommy and God forbid, mommy and daddy something happens, they pass away. What you got? Now you got all the responsibility that you never had yeah. thrown on you, and now you don't you don't want to do. It and people break, and that's where mm -hmm. you get the fucking old drug addicts that had everything in the world, and now you look at them now, they're sitting in the corner and they're asking for change and shit. Yeah. There's nothing else to do. No. Because they didn't have the they didn't have the guidance, you feel me? They thought because they lived at home with mommy and they had everything handed to them, and now they're gone. Now they can't do that. So they're not used to freaking going out there working, waking up on time, doing schoolwork, you know, providing for themselves. They don't have that. Yeah. So as long as, you know, we try to show these kids that there's different ways and there's more opportunities out there than we had when we were growing up, yeah. and, sh and show them, just show them, you see? open up their eyes. So. Oh, boy boy, boy from Lawrence, he's closer, he can go home whenever the hell he oh, wants. Oh, yeah, oh, I go to Lawrence, yeah, I go to Lawrence. <laughs> so you from Philly, you wanna go back home? Hell no. He, he, he chose in Lawrence too. Philly's reckless, bro. <laughs> Philly's reckless. It's the it's the first time, bro. When like, I first I when I first moved into the back. dorms here, bro, yeah. I couldn't sleep because I was waiting on gunshots or like people screaming and shit. Yeah, so yeah it's like it. uh, yeah, low key. <laughs> but then like I got used to the peace and quiet, and I'm just like, bro, I'm chilling. Like I don't want to go home. So you feel like I, I went to go home with my girl. Right, we went to go visit my mom. Yeah. Um, I spent a week out there. Literally the first night I go out there, my girl's outside because like. My girl's from a good neighborhood, she's in a good town, you know, she's not cool. And um, she, she sits outside and, and, and like all you hear is like, bah, 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 bah. And she like, looks at me, I was like, congrats, babe, you know. First yeah. shot in the hood, you know. <laughs> I'm like, I'm yeah. freaking out. I'm like, yo, I forgot how this feels. I'm going to go back home. I'm like, oh, man. I think maybe duck, duck. She was telling you to duck right now, it was too far. So, You're good, those, are, those ain't close by. Nah, but it's, it's definitely like a good environment. I don't have to worry about it, you know, because I've seen a lot of stuff growing up, you know, like crazy stuff, because I've mm -hmm. lived in a bad neighborhood. 
That, that's um, what I was telling him that, most, like most of the time now. All you need is a little guidance, and sometimes yeah, the people, they don't have it. And my guidance, literally, because like my, my family never went to college, you know, like some of my my family is in, in Puerto Rico, they're going to college or school, but like, like my 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 strong family, like my household, like my mom, my dad, her brothers, like they never went to college and shit like that. So like I wanted to do it. So like I didn't know much of it either. I didn't know like where to look for that information. But um, I, I met like this program like called Beat the Streets and stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Um, so they have one in Beat the Streets Province, and and they're starting one up with Beat the Streets Boston, which is cool. And um, I grew up with that program, and they helped me. They guided me with wrestling. They helped me with college. I think I heard of that. Beat the, you should get involved with that, bro. That's so like the best decision I've ever made. It changed my life. Yeah, I met people. I met, I met role models. Like I met people like Ben Ryder, Jim, uh, Jim Mangan. My high school coaches, they were the one that put me on. Max Tannenbaum, yeah. Ben Greer, Matt McConnell. Like I met so many people, so many connections that like, e even after college, I'm gonna be fine with a job because of these people. You know, like people tell you when you get to college, find these connections in college. I'm, I'm happy to say that I found these connections like before that because that's what they do. They help, they help people stay out the street, introduce them to the sport of wrestling. And what I like about them too is that they don't force anything on you. As in what I mean like college wise, you know what I mean? like. What do you want to do with your life? You want to go to college? Let's do it. You want to go to trade school? Let's do it. You want to go to the military? Let's do it. Yeah. They help you chase your goals, bro. So you feel like without them, you wouldn't be here? Honestly, nah. I was going to go to the military. Oh. You know, I was going to just go straight to the military, and that's it. That's what I thought was going to be my, my career, my life, you know? But then they got me into wrestling, and then they got me into getting a mentor. My mentors were like D1 kids. Lorenzo, uh, Lorenzo Thomas, he was an All-American. Um, Kanan. Um, he was a two-time national qualifier for UPenn. Mm -hmm. Like these kids were nasty, and they were also my mentors helping me with uh, my grades. And as I joined, I remember I sucked at math, yeah. right? And Kanan, he was my mentor. He was helping me, and yeah. my grades literally went from like C's and D's to like a B with him, like with math. Yeah, I promise That's you. Crazy. And it's just him just helping me and showing me like the ropes around things, and like you're able to connect with other college kids, with future college kids, so they can also show you the ropes. So like I feel like when I came here too, I was already comfortable because I was around these college kids, you know. So ain't no looking back for you. Nah, man, I'm, you ain't I'm going here. back to Philly. No. This is it here. I want to go back to visit yeah more often, but like I want to focus out here, you know, everything out here first. What's up, man? Well, I'm glad you got a positive mind, bro. Nah, thank you. I appreciate it. Man. Mm -hmm. yeah, you we, we can't forget. We, our other guide here is from Lawrence, and Lawrence ain't no good either right yeah, now. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> And, he, and he's still out here pushing and going to college and wrestling. Jojo, yeah. get on that. Jojo, get on the sidewalk. I know we're recording it, there's not going to be any insurance. You're jaywalking. You guys are doing a good thing, man. Yeah, yeah, all right. So I want to solo with him, you know what I mean? All right, so e every year, me and my friend here, Antonio, we try to bring kids to a university, um, different school usually. I mean, we've done New England College. This is Bridgewater State now. Just trying to give kids an idea of um, the college life. Sometimes coming from um, poverty places or places, you know, of poverty and stuff like that. Like Lawrence, um, these kids don't know anybody that's made it through college, went to college or whatever. And um, this just provides an idea that maybe they could do it. They see kids like Edwin that came from similar situations that are making it through, making it out. And hopefully um, these kids could gain the confidence to go to school and um, become more of themselves. You know, instead of going straight into the work field, it's just mm. an option, man. But we try to present it to them because I know there's a lot of kids just like myself. I had no idea. Nobody in my family ever went to school before myself. So I went I went with no clue on school and I kind of got scared a little bit, you know what I'm saying? So now I know these kids, if you don't, if you don't um, present it to them, they have no idea. So maybe they won't sign up to school, go to school or whatever. So this is just, you know, giving them an idea and hopefully they take um, advantage of this. Yeah. And if they don't, it's okay. If they do, then well, that's great too. But mm -hmm. this is just an opportunity, another opportunity for the, the youth, you know? That's for sure, man. Yeah, just bring them to test the waters, open the eyes, give them more options in life. Yeah. And is it from Edwin's from Philly, our other guys from Lawrence, so anywhere, everywhere. It doesn't mm -hmm. matter from poverty, it doesn't matter if you're from a rich place. You just yeah. gotta have guidance and guide the right way, give you opportunities in life to better yourself. And do it the right way. Yeah. Every, everything's good when you want to make fast cash and shit like that, but then it's high risk. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I, I didn't get the chance to go to college. I didn't have guidance. I had two awesome parents, great parents. I had older sisters, older sister, a great, a great brother. 
But we were just, we were breeded to work. Mm. We wasn't breeded to go to school. So, you know, now I got kids, we all got kids, and we don't want them to work as hard as, as, hard as we work. Yeah. We want them to work, you know, easier, make the good money, and live a great, awesome life. Nice. Man, I'm going to keep it real, man. These two brothers right here always do some good stuff, man. We need to put some spotlight on the Braveheart wrestling. That's right. As Coach Juan, Coach Morales is doing, man. Like these dudes, man, they're really out here putting work. And like I said too, man, they both have families, man, and look where they're at. Showing these kids, uh, guiding these kids for a better life, man. That's what it's about, man. We got to be the mentor to these kids' future, man. We want to do it on the weekends, bro. Yeah. So we all link up. All so it's me. So on the weekend you him, guys chill. Yeah, the like whole this, team mor is this morning I called him and I was like, yo, we have to go grocery shopping and we have to do homework. Yeah. And then and he I was, was like, alright, we have a tour to do, and I was like, alright, let's do it. So yeah, so like we're always active with that. So we stay on top of our the main priority is being here is yeah, like people wanna go out, they wanna go have fun, they wanna go meet people, they wanna go do this or that. That's cool. But what what's better is that you could do that on the weekends and not have to worry yeah, about yeah. doing homework, about waking up and be like, oh, I gotta wake up early, I gotta work all day. Yeah. We get that shit like done in yesterday. the day, and in the weekend, you can do whatever you want. Yesterday, we didn't have any work due. Like, both of us didn't have any work due, but we were like, yo, you wanna just do homework that's due in like a couple of days so we can go out tonight? Because we weren't originally gonna go out. Yeah. And we were like, you wanna just do we it? Just bang it out. Do some that's homework that's due in a couple of days. And so you're ahead of it. Yeah, exactly. yeah. ahead of it, bro. So, like, it, you're gonna, you're, it's gonna make life a lot easier, bro. A lot easier, bro. A lot easier. So if you if you wait in slack, that's what's gonna be a hassle, and then you're gonna be pissed because all be pissed your boys you, and your friends are doing You're not something. enjoying college. You're yeah, trying to end of the semester. You're trying to cram work. Yeah. You're trying to cram point, work. You're just trying to keep up college. with shit. You feel yeah, me? You're just yeah, trying yeah. not to fail, and you can enjoy college because you're just worrying about failing. You're, you're going to classrooms right now, or is it remote? Oh, some. Some of my are, boy yeah. have three in-person classes. One of, one of my friends has an in-person class every day, Fredo. Yeah, yeah, him. Yeah, yeah. So like three, like three in-person classes. But like it's divided. So like I have piano class in that one building, Mokley building, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. But what we did was no class on Monday, every every class Wednesday, and every other day, every other Friday I would have class, mm. which would be lit. You feel me? Yeah. But, yeah. but like it would, it would be like that. Yep. Yeah. My class will come at a different time. So even yeah. though that That's was good. How is it so far? We still here. I'm gonna hit y'all back in a bit. I want to say, give a nice shout out to Edwin Lucas. Came from Philly, came from Lawrence out here wrestling, Bridgewater State. Took us on a tour for Young Bucks here to get a little taste of college life. So I want to say thank you for you guys. You guys see these guys, support them, wrestling, show them some know, love. Nah, you got Whatever sport you do, it's, it's still popping. Yeah. Yeah, do you guys have an Instagram? Uh, yeah, I got Instagram as uh, capital N E, no, capital N, and everything is lowercase E M U dot 184. Follow me there. Um, Lucas Papora, L U C A S P U R P O R A. Yeah, these are also wrestlers too that are my teammates up, and stuff. Y'all yeah, yeah. wanna like say a couple, say what's up to them, say ask a couple words. What's up? Yeah, Fredo he, David? Yeah, it's my boy, Captain, too. That's okay. his brother, older brother. Okay, okay. Yeah, okay. yeah look alike. Yeah. So, yeah. It's a wrestling house, man. We all, we all out here to support each other. Yeah, bro, y'all are welcome we do it. whenever you want. You guys come. If you, We do open mats, too, next season, probably. We'll do open mats. Yeah, too. And, like, we also, yeah. I know it's probably going to be a little drive, too, but, like, if y'all want to go to Brick Road, yeah, they're always club. looking to, uh, to to bring kids in and yeah, stuff like that and train. So I'm there Tuesdays and Thursdays. So Tuesday from 5 to 7, Thursdays from 7 to 9. Yeah. And there's good kids from, like, the dungeon. I don't know, like, all state champs and Shit like that. New England Gold. Yeah, New England Gold. They all go there. So if y'all want to, and college kids go there too. So if y'all want to just get some scrapping and y'all want to train with the kids, with us, you know what I'm saying? We'll, we'll be, we'll be valid with that. Y'all yeah, always valid. You guys are gonna be on my YouTube channel, so. Nah, I appreciate sure. that. Let you guys know when it's up. Cool, cool, nah, bad, bad, bad. 
Just again, keep doing what y'all doing, man. Y'all do, in the house. Yeah. yeah, man. Y'all doing good. Just keep up what y'all doing, man. No matter what, just keep working hard, bro. Yeah, y'all doing good, bro. No matter what, even if it's here, Bridgewater is anywhere. Make sure y'all make a good decision. It's acting like it's good for you. Do your work, bro. Do your work too, bro. Make sure it's smart. Make sure it's good. Get that degree before before anything, bro. Get that degree. That's the most important, bro. Cause no shawty, no dude, no 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 one's gonna give you a degree. They're gonna give you money. You feel me? You gotta work for that. You're paying to get that degree. Yeah, man. So no matter what. Future for that bread in the future. Yeah, bro. You wanna make forty? You wanna make eighty? College. You wanna make a hundred? College. You wanna make forty? Much. It was good seeing y'all, man. Thank you, bro. Nice meeting you guys. Appreciate y'all, homies, man. Y'all be safe. Y'all be easy. Yeah, Alright, homie. Thank you, man. Thank you. Yeah. Alright, brother. Nice meeting you. Any more questions? Applications too. Like, just look it up. It's mad simple too. You look it up on the website. Apply here and stuff. If y'all need help, I send I send Coach the link. He'll send it to y'all guys. You guys will do it and stuff like that. But most important too, you're so early. Apply to other schools too, man. Yeah. You feel me? Don't just limit this to be. Get a, a bunch know? of applications. Out there. Find out what's good. What other schools are nearby, far, wherever you want to go. You know what I'm saying? And what's what's good? What's a good choice for you? Where College you fit is invest? an investment, so just what's invest in the right yeah, thing. Yeah. So. Scholarships. Yeah, scholarships what's too, or grants, all that thing. So whatever you want, make sure it's gonna fit. It's good. It's gonna be good for you, your family, mm -hmm. yourself. Yeah. That you're gonna grow there physically and mentally, bro. Before we took off, how many years you stay in college? What's your major? How, like, what year am I in? Yeah, what year are you I, in? I'm a junior right now. My major is business management, and my concentration is public relations. What were you? Yeah, I'm a junior. My major is criminal justice. So I'm going to be here for a couple more years. Right, what were you? Uh, I'm a senior. I graduate this semester. Okay. Uh, my major is aviation management. So what were you? Uh, history yeah, and secondary education. Yeah, I'll probably be here for eight years, getting my master's. That's what's up, man. You guys got some bright ass features, man. Uh, yeah, we got another one in the back. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's C-Dub. That's C-Dub. Uh, I'm a senior. I'm a, my major is uh, in psychology with a concentration in uh, sports and coaching. That's what's up, oh, man. Oh, yeah. That's yeah, what's man. up. We out here. We just trying yeah, to make bro. the better, make the world better place little by little, man. And I'm a YouTuber. <laughs> 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 yeah, man. They got like something virtually. So yeah, that's what's up, man. You got um, you have an Instagram? You guys want to put out Instagram stuff like that? Yeah, I want to. I'm not a big private. social media guy. <laughs> I have one, but like I don't man. post or anything. <laughs> 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 just follow the college wrestling Bridgewater. Support the team. What's your social media? Follow me at C-Dub underscore Lamar, you heard? That's what's we up, out here? man. That's what's up, yeah. man. Get, the, get, get money, too, with the wrestling, man. We got, we got Bright Rising Stars coming up, too. Follow the wrestling page That's on Instagram. What is it, buddy? BSU Bears. That's BSU Bears, man. man. You see that, and for man? the record, we can't forget about Bravehearts. Bravehearts, too, Brave yeah. Hearts, yeah. 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 Nice they they me out. Yeah, I got them. He's a senior. Oh, wait, do they know senior. And senior. senior. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, that's my dad, that's my dad coached him. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah. That's what's up, man. Oh, yeah. You ready, Ant? Yeah. Yeah. Back to the queue? Yeah. yeah. Oh. That's what's up, man. I'll catch him. Man, it, was a, it was a pleasure coming here. You can take him? I think I can take him. By my son, my nephew. Uh, last year I wrestled that. Did a little tour. So, you know, it's important, man. We got to... As followers, oh, we gotta be in our the, kids' I, life, I, I, man, and I show them the future, man. Yeah. Uh, uh, right now, I'm having like, a little I thing just, with my son. Yeah, yeah, he don't want to go to college, you know what I mean? But we'll like we'll talk more into that a little further more. But I, I, he's I a smart kid, has a good future. Yeah, Q. Yeah, Q. Oh, Q. Yeah, yeah, my shit. My dad actually, yeah, that tournament, that tournament I'm talking about. But yeah, man. So you know. That's the whole goal of being, you know what I'm saying, your kid's life, man, and, and guide them for a better future. You know? Guide them in life as much as you can, man. All the followers out there, man, we got to be in our kid's life. We got to make a difference, man, for real, for real. Got accepted. That's why we were going to come down here to bring him. Hold on. Y'all like that fit, yo. Oh, yo, thank you. Ah, that's a good shout out, yo. Actually, this is my friend. I went to elementary school with this kid. He just made this. He's been spreading it. He got like cowboy and all them wearing it. Navali. You can have that's, that's, that's a Navali, good shout out, man. yo. I, I keep that though. I keep that though, man. I like that. <laughs> <laughs> Fire. Uh -oh. Yeah, 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 yeah no, nah, I don't care, yo. Up, I got a, this is the Ugg gang. Look, this is the Ugg gang. Y'all stay cozy, yeah. Oh, I'm gonna wear the Max. 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 Yes, sir. Max 97. That's on there, bye. Two, like a couple seconds. Okay.
That's a couple that's seconds that buy it. I got some beat up things on for the snow, but it's, it is what it is. <laughs> <laughs> but I like that fit, though. That's fire. Yeah, exactly. I like the, I like the, the, the uh, colors. I'll, the I'll send you a link if you need, or that's what's up, I gotta find it. That's it. Bet is give it to everyone. Everyone said it's one of us. Yeah, that's crazy. But how long is the trip back home? No, I really can't complain. Everything is straight. Turn into the real thing I tell her I am